What was your monster condom for your magnum dong? Is not good enough. You dong kong, you conky dong. You schlong, schlong Johnson. Oh, Don Piano. Long Dick Johnson. Oh, Long Johnson. All the live long day. He's my favorite character in Fallout in Vegas. <laughs> What's his name? Long Dick Johnson. What, what, where is he in New Vegas? I've never seen him. No, just somebody that Cassidy says when she's just saying stuff like... Uh, I think it's about like Kaiser or maybe the, the Republic in Sierra. Mm -hmm. Alright, it's like they think their dick's really long or whatever. Nobody's dick's that long. Not even Long Dick Johnson's <laughs> dick is that long. Ali says I have no idea how cock rings work. How oh, what? what? <laughs> if it touches cock, it doesn't go back in stock. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that would be a good sign. <laughs> <laughs> Tell Allie. D no, she can hear me. Fuck it. Ten <laughs> points to Gryffindor. <laughs> <laughs> see, see, they, they, you, you need another one though for if it touches the vagine. Um, it goes. I into can't. The dis <laughs> I, I can't help you uh, with your. I, I no, don't know. I was about to say. It, um, if it touches the vagine, it goes into the trash machine. But... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> if it touches the vagina, the problem ain't mina. <laughs> I was about to say. If it touches the vagina, the pro the, pro the problem isn't mina, but. If, it, if you touch a vagina, it's only a problem if it's a mina. <laughs> Yeah. M-I-N-E-R, you retard. Yeah. <laughs> what did you think? <laughs> I was about to say, to be fair, I think it's a problem no matter what you're touching there. <laughs> <laughs> What's your issue with fucking miners? I don't um, know, they're just like I don't know, they're covered in coal. after they get out of the mine. Yeah. They're, they're hardworking people. <laughs> yeah, I understand that, but like, take a shower first, please. Yeah, I mean, that's mandatory. Like, I'm ready for a night of hot passion, but I don't want to be smelling soot the whole but, time. But to be fair, like, if you have a well-cleaned mana in front of you... <laughs> mm, just, yeah, sign me up. Like, you can keep on, you can keep on the hard hat. The really bad thing is I feel so fucking dirty right now! <laughs> hey, like a miner? Sorry, give me a minute. Hey, sorry. If you want, I could tell you some stories about some miners left in some dark cages someplace in a, in a warehouse somewhere. I don't, I don't know uh, if that should. I don't know. <laughs> I no no. <laughs> no, I think Sai knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> Sai yeah, knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> we don't That's... take anything that touches lips. <laughs> Whoa. No, actually, Quaddy, it's a 100% serious story. Yeah. Um, about, I mean, you know, I mean, about the miners in a warehouse. Uh, I mean, to be fair, you shouldn't be debating that on, in a public environment. Um, I'm just gonna clear myself right now by saying they're not mine. <laughs> yeah. Or anybody who I associate with. Okay. As a matter of fact, I freed them in my job, but that's neither here, neither here nor there. Good job, Hopkins. <laughs> Hopkins FBI. <laughs> We've said too much. Quick, ban, ban me oh, off Twitch. Who the fuck is that other guy? That Quick, delete forgetting. the internet. Jack Orlando. Have you seen Jack Orlando? <laughs> Um, I've seen enough to know where, what you're getting at. <laughs> he's so fucking terrible. He's such an asshole. <laughs> like, he just lives to be the worst human being. He's he a terrible detective, too. <laughs> at the end of the game, he has like a hundred items in his inventory and he doesn't use fucking half of them. <laughs> oh, he could what's just this keep say? shit up. 
What's Aren't this? We still a shit I, to human being? I just saw the part where he puts a fucking horseshoe in a punching glove and like beats the guy up with it because he wouldn't let him like mess around in, in like his broken down car or some shit. It was like. No, he wanted the crank <laughs> for the car. Or yeah. It was like, for some reason. It's like, Jack, Jesus Christ. Like, fuck. It's a classic case of like, dude, calm your please. Yeah, for real. Alright. So I've been through there. I'm gonna get back. Oh yeah, here we go. So warp. I want to... Go to... I guess Cave of Serpents. Nothing's like funny. Get back to the cavern, or to the. I can go into the cabin now. What? Nothing. nothing. If it touched you, puss, you better shush. We want none of that. The the um the best thing is for me, when it comes to my last name in video games, my my last name is like so common from like the old like. Forties, fifties, like wasp kind of name, you know. Wasp. A uh, white angel, white and Anglo-Saxon Protestant. Oh. Is it poop? Shoot? So. Basically, part wasp. Dookie a shooter. <laughs> basically, I'm part wasp. So what I'm saying is, is it's always great for me. Like, whenever I'll play like video games that take place in like the 30s, 40s, and 50s, and every now and again I'll hear my last name being like, hey. <laughs> Hey, forget about it. Like in the beginning of uh, Dark Corners of the Earth, they say my last name. Yeah. Uh, the main character of Call of Duty 3 has my last name. Yeah. Ooh. Which is great. Because last name, name is Call of Duty? Call of Duty, get over here. Whoa, that thing just too shot me. Your last name is Ramirez? I said Call of Duty. It's a Call of Duty 3. Tree. The one with I the white people. I am only in Greece and the Muppets. What? Allie is only in Greece and the Muppets. Is she into greasing up Muppets? I mean... That's what I was wondering about. Why is she talking about uh, greasing up Muppets? <laughs> Kermit's uh, not gonna get his fucking self now, is he? Allie, you nasty. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, to be fair, there was there was that one porno that was shot completely done with puppets. There's only one. Uh, I don't know. I've only seen one that the cinnamon, the why did I almost call him the cinnamon Scrooge? Because I keep calling him the cinnamon Scrooge. Yeah, the uh, cinema snob did a review on it. Cinnamon Scrooge. Yes. It's what Link Carr is. <laughs> That grandma. Doosh. Hey, you fucking douche. Hey, I'm fucking walking here. Ooh, we got dark armor. Is that See, not, good... That's not as good as my other armor. See, the good no, thing about being we not. Me and Claudia is we come, we come from the part of the world where we know how to say the word douchebag properly. You douchebag. You how do I get past bag. this thing without getting hit again? Because I'm going to die if it hits me. It's a fun one. That's... <laughs> Can I hit it in the head? No. It's incorporeal. Like the... I could try to... No? Oh! I managed to survive a second shot. Okay. It's like the favorite swear word in oh, New okay. York and New Jersey is douche bay. Hey, you fucking douche. Hey, God, I hear you, Baba Ganoush, you fucking douche. <laughs> Dog censorship. <laughs> Fuck shit. Okay, um, I did that. I don't think there's anything else in the forest for me to do now. I, I feel like I'm pretty much, like, completed through everything up to the castle. Except for that weird door that I can't open. And if there's anything in the clock, but at this point I'm like, eh, whatever. I, I feel pretty... I feel pretty far along in here. Would you say I'm like 75% or more? Mmm, 65 to 70, I'd say. Damn it. 
this one. Yeah, it's not a game in this game. Yeah. It's not a game hot in this dogs. game. Get your hat dogs. Get your hat dogs. One of my favorite Retza Prey lines ever is when they played uh, Quiet Falls, which is like a Newgrounds um, Silent Hill knockoff. And um, there's this creature that's kind of bending over like its own back and then its head sticking out through its legs. And uh, it, it looks like it's flipping you off all the time. And Diabetes dice decided to give it uh, like a New Yorker accent. And and at one point they walk past and he's like, Hey, what's the big idea? I'm fingering my butthole over here. Get out of the way, I'm fingering it. <laughs> and it's like my favorite line. It's it's just it comes out of nowhere, but it hits you really hard. <laughs> I'm fingering it. Just like the twist in Quiet Falls. What? AIDS fucker. <laughs> yeah. What a, what a, what a... Whew. They put his dick in a box. Shit. Wait, your name is the AIDS fucker? It's like, whoa, that's uncouth and uncalled for. That's not a very good name. No. My, um, I don't know, my, still my favorite joke throughout any Retsu Prey that was like a, a running joke throughout it was Jogger Dave. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Ali and I are big fans of Jagger Dave. He's I actually bought boy. that game after that, just to stream it one day, but I never got to it. Yeah. Oh, oh you mean totally true, not fake horror, horror stories? stories? Yeah. The Flash game? I killed him. I killed the whiz robe. The Flash game that you have to buy on Steam for like, 70 cents? Yeah. Oh, yeah. fuck. Did I just break the game? To be fair, the original Binding of Isaac also was a flash game. Sai, I broke the game. Yeah, but here's the difference. The Binding of Isaac is actually good. Yeah, it's like... Impressive, Tenno. It's like Unity games. I hit the enter door button too quickly, and I think it killed it. <laughs> Whoops. Whoops. Mm. Just quickly restarted. The difference between a bad flash game and a good one is, um, effort. Is there sex in it? I'm gonna play the, uh, I'm gonna if play no, the I don't prologue want, demo real I don't quick. even care. Oh, man. What was the name of that one, like, series oh, of games that, uh, Red Supreme was doing, where, like, the first two were flash games and the third one they had to buy for, like, 14 bucks? Oh, Ex Mortis. Yeah, Ex Mortis. Yeah, Ex Mortis is some quality shit. That's a yeah. gas mask. There's it's a gas so, mask shooting. You are right, it is some shit. But I'm not sure quality would be the term the term I would use for it. <laughs> well, to watch. I mean viewing material. Wise. You know. You know what I mean. You know what I mean. Oh, double popsicle, yes. Oh, big spooky mask. Oh, big spooky mask was an enemy. And he just walked off screen. Okay. I mean, I mean, all right. Unlocked. Pub. I got 69 coins. Nice. This is really cool that they uh, put like a game demo in there. Oh god. Ow. Oh, Jesus. You do lose health incredibly quickly, though. Gotta say. Yeah, you used to thing on Bubba to your uh, armor at some <laughs> point. Yeah, I'm used to having that. That was nice. Those are good days. I could take a hit. Back in the D. Oh, that's a cute cloud. That's an angry skeletal. Oh wait, can I break this wall for wall chicken? No. Wall of chicken. Oh Jesus. The mask boy is watching me. My dick is a monster. 
Like, found a note. Leap west where the journey begins. Okay. Eruption. Charge then release attack button. I don't know, Claudia. I always find that these streams that we do become more and more quality as the night goes on. Yeah. Because we get that 2.30 brain going. Mm. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Back at Becker, uh, Dusty always said, like, nothing good happened after 2.30, but I... I... Oppose nothing that. productive happened after 2.30. Yeah. I think he's full of shit. Everything. Yeah, yeah fuck you, Dusty. I don't know who the fuck Dusty is, but fuck him. You don't know what he's talking about. Hey, Frog Boy. Oh god, am I gonna have to fight Frog Boy? Oh no, I have to fight large uh, t tiger large man with, with tiny legs. Oh Jesus. Large Marge? Large Barge Marge. Oh, you got Holy. Frog Lord. Yeah. Oh, fuck, they bounce! Shit! Oh, I have to start the prologue all over? Damn it. Son of a bitch. That's a pain in the butt. Ouch. It's a long way to go back. I gotta say. You know what's the upsetting thing about the uh, Rick and Morty fan base? Uh, Spaghetti. 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 Well, that'd be a positive thing if we introduced them to Spaghetti. Spaghetti. Because then they'd know what it takes a true genius to understand the humor of. <laughs> or, or, or just some uh, good old fashioned uh, you boy. Oh! Oh, I just went through the wall. Fuck you, game. Sequence breaking. <laughs> well, no. What I was going to say is the fact that I have to lop them together when it comes to, like, TV show fans in the same boat as, like, Doctor Who fans. Hmm. Or the fact that they actually have a... Oh, I fucking hate them. <laughs> I don't like... know anything about Doctor Who, so I can't... That's like... Mm, I the only thing Doctor. I know about Doctor Who is that I fucking love Leela. Oh, I was rained upon. Oh, is that an actual character that you're talking about? Like the yeah, he was role. like with like the fourth Doctor at one point. I watched like a couple of the old episodes because Netflix had them, and she was just ready to cut fucking everybody. <laughs> like hell yeah, that's great. No, but what I was gonna say is the fact that like. Doctor Who fans are like the type of people where it's like, I'm a fan of Doctor Who, so therefore I'm in a, a higher class structure than you could ever hope to be in, you fucking plebeian. Plebeian. Mm. My yeah, it's always like those fake fucking intellectuals who watched it, you know. You can't understand the, um, the whole science fiction aspect of traveling through time, you fucking primordial. Yeah, I can. Pilot. Time travel Shit. sucks. It never makes sense. Sucks. Shit. And then I'm like, might I add, the only reason why I watched Doctor Who at any point in time was because Amy Pond. I wanted. I mean, I'd stick my dick in it. I never. Oh. Really... I'd fill that pond with some scum if you know what I'm saying. Yuck. <laughs> Yuck. <laughs> Gotta clean that up. That's what a fucking douchebag's for. Fucking douchebag! <laughs> I mean, technically speaking, I'm just, I'm just being realistic here. That's what it's for. I'm not being gross or anything. God damn it! I mean, if anything, you're being a fucking douchebag here for pointing that out. You fucking douche. Douchebag. Oh, secret key. Oh, that unlocks the. Oh shit! Lock. It's a secret. It's a secret. Cats are the guardians of the underworld. Says who? Says cats. Says cats. 
You, you, you know what I say takes some real fucking intelligence? Meet a person who will watch Dr. Katz. <laughs> that was that was an interesting show. Ah, oh, that show is fucking great. You know what show takes some real fucking intelligence to laugh at? Well, to find somebody who watches home movies. Now that's a guy you hang out with. You know what show takes really fucking intelligence to laugh at? Shortcut? Oh, Shortcut? Oh, what would that be? Dateline. <laughs> uh, I want to date some lines. Hello, I'm Chris Hansen. Uh, <laughs> would you please come in? Oh, that fuck. shit's funny as fuck. <laughs> oh, it is. I love it. Do you think it's appropriate to tell a 14 year old girl that you want to, and I quote, ram your fingers up her poop shoe? <laughs> she said she was 18, damn it. Yesterday I talked to a 14 year old girl online <laughs> Suddenly she's all like I'm an FBI agent Ain't that fucking cool so young and already at the FBI <laughs> Well I actually have a story for you I was um I was recently Going to troll some chat rooms Cause I enjoy doing that every now and again I like to be my own personal blood dragon I mean not blood ninja And I uh I go in there and I'm like, so how old are you? And then they're like 16. I'm like, wait a minute, what are you doing here? <laughs> and I'm like, hey, why would you just openly say it? They're like, well, I don't know. You know, there used to be a room where the teenagers could go, but you know, they closed that. I'm like, well, for obvious reason. I'm like, what are you doing still online at 2 o'clock? You still need fucking parents' permission to go on clubpenguin.com, you loser. Wow. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Some basic guidelines that will never break in life. Clubpenguin.com. <laughs> Makes sense. Nah, it's like if I see somebody who's like, if I hear like talk or like, I, I don't know, like I see like somebody who's 16 and like chat rooms like that. I'm like, no, get out of here, gross. You green leave. effect, leave. green in the options menu. Leave. Goal one out of two. Never come back. Okay, so are there different ways to finish the demos? Ah, uh. that's weird. I want to play the last demo shown at E3. Blah, 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 blah. Welcome to your doom. I'm into my doom. Ooh. It's interesting because the different demos actually feel kind of different to play. Like, they feel like different builds of the game, which is interesting. Maybe I'm to be just... fair, they most likely are. Yeah. But it's it's interesting that they kept them in, like, the final game, that it feels different, but... Yeah. It's kind of neat. I like it. It's pretty cool. My good game gives two thumbs up. Not get that key. I want that key. Give me that key. Give me that fucking. Key. We here at the Quadraxis 14 streams will make fun of some heavy topics, but we also do not condone them. Twin Hydra. That's just a triclide, you boobers. Unless, of course, it's uh, abortion in the uh, 200th trimester, in which case we're all for it. <laughs> is that. Okay, so. What is that? <laughs> The 200th trimester, that's the 600th month. No, yeah, but... Is is that a, a real thing that we're joking about, or... I'm just well, curious Cy... if that comes from something, because Sai was talking about it earlier, and you brought it up. Well, now, yeah, I was just like... more or less making a reference to what Sai was talking about. Okay. Basically, what we're saying is that some people just don't deserve to live. Yeah. Sometimes what they need is a good ace whoop. So just, just a good old fashioned ace whoop. Heard you were talking shit, boy. Heard you were talking shit. Hi there, I heard you were talking shit and me and Miss Piggy just thought we'd come to your house and fuck you up. 
gonna that rip your legs you. off and beat you with them. That ought to learn you. Yeah. That's why you don't fuck with Jim Henson and Co. <laughs> I own the Muppets property. Jim Henson ain't around no more. He's not gonna get you out of this shit. <laughs> I'm gonna dump person? you in a lake. The Muppet <laughs> fish are gonna fucking eat you. And they're all gonna have old man faces from those little sketches at the theater. It's gonna fucking eat you. There's only one person who you should be more scared of, and that's fucking Mickey Mouse. I mean, I don't even fuck with him. <laughs> yeah, I hear he has torture dungeons and utilidors. What the fuck's a utilidor? That's just fucking weird. Whoa. You ever hear of that Disney Lost Island creepypasta? Yeah, that isn't fake. Wow, the, the red ring that you get in the E3 demo is fucking ridiculous. You just shoot like a million things. You just shoot like a million little blops out of your sword now. Oh, oh, it's Bone Dragon. Hi, Bone Dragon. I, I'm not fond of you. Oh, this, this is not a good boss to put in the E3 demo. This guy's so, a fucking goober. Buddy, I recently decided. I think we all would have had a really great time if I were going if I were going to Banker at the same when like if Just I went to Banker at the same time as you album. guys do. Basics 15 cheesy singles. <laughs> it's just a pack of cheese. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, now that I think about it, we probably all wouldn't have had a great time uh, if I went to Becker with you boys, because my first year of college I was a depressed, drunken mess. Oh, I found zero to two secrets. Well, oh, you would have been like the rest of us, except you were more drunk than us. Yeah. That would have worked. Oh, I'm 71% complete. After three hours, it says? Three hours? Yeah, your deaths aren't... Like, a death time isn't counted. Oh! Oh, it resets, okay, with each death. Yeah, because I was gonna be like, yeah, I've been playing the game for a lot longer than that. It's, just, it's fucking ridiculous. Get out of here. So yeah, I'm 70% through. That's something. That's some shit. Hey, that's some shit. That's some shit. I'm not oh, exactly I'm getting an axe from one of these guys. Give me huh? your axes. Give me your asses. Just grind the one on the left, it's faster. Yeah, I'm doing that. Give me that boy. Give me that boy! I was also missing one armor. Do you know where that would happen to be? Mm, let me see your armor screen in a, in a bit, please. Okay. Oh! I got it. Got the executioner. Tell you it's not the talk to farm. Yeah, that wasn't bad. Honestly, I feel like getting the sushi took longer. Merman. Oh, I haven't been that way yet. Let's see here. Let me just see if I can. I do not like the axe as a weapon. It's you gotta get used to it, but it's really good for the time you get it at damage-wise. Yeah. I just think I have so much better stuff at the time. Uh, you can normally only have gotten the, the wrong sword at that point in time. I think. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, uh, no, the boomerang. Yeah, the boomerang. And it does a lot more damage than the boomerang, to be fair. So I'm missing whatever comes before blood armor. Before blood armor. Oh. You're also still missing a uh, weapon. A weapon? Oh yeah, whatever comes before the dawn sword. Still missing quite a few weapons, to be honest. 
Yeah. That I could get at this point, or that I'm gonna get later on. Uh, I think you can get most things. Okay. Uh, the, the armor you're missing is in the Windy Ruins. Okay, yeah, I haven't explored that at all, so... I'll see you guys later. Right, have a good one. Have a good one, Brando. Ooh, lost page. Oh, I have to Goomba jump, I guess. Or is that a thing? Hmm. I don't know if I can get the height that I need for that. Oh wait, yes. if I hold down jump, maybe. Oh yeah! Oh, sweet. Okay. Fuck. <laughs> Bonk my head right on there. Oh, the Goombas just can't do damage to you anymore. That's funny. Oh, I never changed out my axe from here. Shit. Come on, buddy. I got work to do. Hurry up. Yeah. There we go. It's another lost page. I think that's four, maybe. But I think there are still quite a few weapons and quite a few. Uh, magic spells you can get. Yeah. Oh shoot, let me do this. Jump, jump, oh fuck. So I had a pretty good moment the other day. Yeah. I saw a, uh, an old teacher of mine who once told me I wasn't gonna go anywhere. Mm -hmm. And I got to walk up to him the other day and go, ha I'm a fucking millionaire! <laughs> Beat his ass with money it was, uh, it was her, it was a she. She goes, Oh, oh she, sorry I'm dead. Oh, that's she used to, the monster she used to tell me in class. She's like, oh, why don't you do your work? You're never gonna go anywhere. I'm like, oh yeah, show you. Have you seen this guy, Sai? The sorry I'm no. dead guy? No, I haven't. That's funny thing. That's funny. Yeah, because there were those blocks over there. I was like, there should be something there. And there you go. <laughs> Sorry, I'm dead guy. I just love the pointless rooms that just have, like, little cameos and references and stuff. Mm. It's a good time. Okay. So let's get Dawn back on. That should be on already, but yeah. Shock shoots a bouncing electrical crystal. Oh. I wonder if that would work on that section. so far apart. Oops. I died. <laughs> you still need to get the white orb, right? No. I already got it and charged it. Do you know where to go? No. But I got it and charged it. Oh. I just took it back to the witch she said to bring her a white orb. I got it. Somewhere. And then I brought it to her.
And then Allie ogled, uh, ogled her the whole time. death. Okay. They're like stairs, or like the shape of stairs leading downwards into spikes, and I was like, not all spikes are real. Nope, those ones are real. Hashtag not all spikes. Hashtag not all spikes. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what to do in that lightning room. Alright, 2 a.m. It's the 2 a.m. second wind. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ellie says, y'all bedtime, but I say, y'all video games. I am getting a little tired, but let's just see how far I can get. I feel, I feel like the forward momentum is, is improving. I feel like I'm, I'm starting to get further along. Now that there's less stuff to open and unlock and backtrack for. So... Uh. How are we gonna spend this two o'clock second wind of newfound energy and hope? Uh, murdering this game. Bitch, I'm your goddamn fiance, and you'll sleep before you die. <laughs> That's shit. I mean, Ooh, yeah. Guess who's sleeping on the couch tonight, bitch? Ooh, not Ooh. me, because we don't even live in the same house. Ooh. Well, you know what? 
I don't even have a couch in the vicinity to sleep on. I mean, if she told me to, then, you know. I mean, that would be comfy. Different, you know, change of pace. Sleep on a different couch. Or just a different bed. Maybe I'll enjoy sleeping on the couch. I don't know. Sleep on the floor! Sleep in a dungeon! Oh, well, maybe I'll enjoy sleeping in a dungeon. Yeah. Try it out. What if it's the Mickey Mouse dungeon? Yeah. Ooh, no, gross. I don't want to sleep in the Mickey Mouse dungeon. I think so. He's gonna Peach. stick his peeper up my pooper. His peeper up your pooper? Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> oh. Mickey's into some weird shit. Oh. I'm gonna stick my peeper up his pooper. You wanna see my peeper come off? Okay. <laughs> oh boy. Y'all niggas ever been to a <laughs> Mickey Mouse just shows up. Y'all niggas ever been to a rodeo? <laughs> <laughs> um, no, Mickey, no. Please. There's children. No, Mickey. Mickey? Mickey? Mickey Mouse? Mis Misky Mouse? Musketeers? Like like Elon Musk or a musky boy? Mickey gonna fuck you up? Mickey gonna fuck you? He ain't gonna fuck you up. Mickey's just gonna fuck you. He don't... <laughs> but bullshit, your bed is a couch, <laughs> literally. <laughs> she is not wrong. I have a oh. futon. <laughs> I always wanted to sleep on a futon. They're, it's fun. It's, it's a nice, it's a nice couch bed. They're really hard to find. Like shit, man. I don't know. Maybe it's just New Jersey being shit so, and everything, but you know. So they're so easy to find in Europe. Futon is my jam. So uh, quality. Yeah. Um. When I do decide to, if I do decide, and whenever it is, and I of course check the time frame with, with you as well, I'll come to visit you at some point. And you don't have kill to kill you. you. Huh? Oh, I was about to say. Um, I was about to say kill you. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, basically what I was going to say was just for, just for the sake of. Um, Money saving reasons. Woo. I will pay food. However, question. Uh, would it be chill if I stayed at your place? I don't fuck, I'll sleep on the floor. I do it sometimes anyway. That's not up to me because I don't own my house. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forget that. Yeah. It's, that is kind of not my uh, area of um, authority. I forgot it. I always forget that you don't. I'm one of them parent living with beasts. It's... I mean, shit. I'll just sleep out. I'll just sleep out whatever fucking car I get. I'm gonna fuck. What I'm saying is, I don't. I don't really care for hotels. Mm -hmm. Hotels are shit. They're weird and I never feel comfortable unless I'm sharing a hotel with them. Ooh, baby. No, just generally because of the fact of that. I might have saw the movie Psycho in my formative years. <laughs> yeah. So, and you don't like showers anymore. I You'll mean, never like take a shower again, Psycho. I mean, <laughs> I mean, I like showers. I just don't like them in motels or hotels. Holiday Inns. Whatever. Come on. Aw, oh, come on, Holiday Inn Express has fucking nice ass showers. That, that would be a great shower to die in. in time, you kinda gotta wonder if Chu's are only taking baths. Oh my god, it's Owl Guy again. He's back. He's back, and I'm gonna kill him. Oh, he's gonna kill me by knocking me off this tower. You got the people! Whoa, oh, I just went through blocks. Hell's key. 
escaped. Is there anything in the, in the to that? To the man. I understand. Hey, it's cocktail. <laughs> that was great. Um, is there anything to do up on this tower side? If I jump off the side, will I die? Don't think so. No. Okay. Oh. Oh, I got a Gale Cutter spell. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Gale Cutter is dope as fuck. It is dope as fuck. It, like, gives you a whirlwind thing and then cuts bitches. Cuts hoes? Cut bitches, bitches and hoes? Both the bitches and hoes should know I'm trying to correct this. <laughs> oh yeah, but there's only bitches and hoes should know I'm trying to correct this. I actually, um, today somebody mentioned the word kebab, and I was like, I can't believe that I'm kebab. sharing bad with the most beautiful girl I have ever seen with the kebab. With the kebab. And I can't believe I'm, I'm sharing a kebab. kebab. With the most beautiful girl I have ever seen with the, the band. Quality, when I go to New Jersey, we should find a place to do karaoke and just do nothing but uh, play the Concord's tunes. Yes. I'll sing the Jermaine bits, you sing the. I forget. Uh, Fuck! The... Uh, Brett. Brit. Brit. Yeah. Hey, Brit. You're legendary. <laughs> Dave, <laughs> would you mind if I do? Said so Dave, do you mind if I do? I can, I can tell he kind of minds, but I'm gonna do it anyway. <laughs> I'll be the racist dragon. Well, not anymore. Uh, to answer your qu uh, my question, Sai, you do die <laughs> if you jump off the side. Oh. Well, I'm, I'm glad I went back and saved first. <laughs> okay, so no reason to go back in there. Then. I'm gonna see what's down here. Oh! There's a pit of spikes down there. Good, good. We're learning things. You know, you know what I'm thinking now, playing this game? Mm. I had a really good-ass time playing uh, Salt and Sanctuary. Like, that was, yeah. a, that was a really nice game. I replayed it recently. Yeah. He's a dank-ass game. He's dank. I like Ronin Cran. Yeah. Ooh, I got Moonbow. Oh, that's fucking sweet. I actually like that a lot. Oh my god. Just tossing all the boys. The most beautiful girl in the room. Gung in the whole world. Gung near for 13,000. I need another 2,000 for that, but I will be back for Gung near. Gung near. I see you wearing that ugly, that baggy sweater you got from that team building exercise a few years back. Team building exercise 99. Whoa. Yeah, baby. Team building exercise 99. I, I like your 99. mishearing. Of, I like your mishearing of the lyric. The team building exercise Not tonight. Yeah. I, I, still, I still mix it up that way. It's like, hmm, normally team building exercises, but not tonight, baby. Team building <laughs> exercises, not tonight. Tuesday night's the night where we go over to your mother's house and I teach her how to use the video machine again. 
Well, Wednesday night is the night Wednesday that we night. make love. The conditions are perfect for making love. It's perfect. It's perfect, baby. Oh, shit. Do 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 do. No 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 no. Do 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 do. Oh goodness. Oh, I don't need that. Oh, Ooh, double jumps. Where are you currently at? Um in the room with the skeleton. Yeah, I just found it. Ooh, you can just jump you can just walk over everything. That's funny. Way better. Oh, well oh, there we go. Make a love. <laughs> Make a love. Oh are you see <laughs> Make a love for two. Is it just for that joke? Like number two of not trusting what? pipes. No. No. Okay. One of the pipes. Or no, I skipped the pipes, and something is good after that. Here we go. After the pipe. After the pipe. Or not. No. Oh. What the fuck? What? It just reset the game. What just happened? You got pranked, son. What? Sigh. Let me, let me quickly see it. There is something there. Oh, in the middle is Glitch World. Oh, oh, fucking what? I what? see you found it. <laughs> uh, well, the third one just reset the game. <laughs> oh, Jesus. This is upsetting. Oh my god. Oh, that's an angry boy over there. Okay. Do 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 do. This is. This, this turned it into a puzzle game now. Oh. Into what? I feel like I'm trying to navigate a puzzle game. A what? I'm in a glitch world right now and it's fucking. Crazy. Oh god. What is even. What is my life? <laughs> to be fair, you only do that for the achievement. There's nothing here. You'll eventually die. Oh, yeah, I just died. Okay, so that that's all that's there. Die in captivity anyway. Yeah. Alright, well, that was interesting. So nothing towards completion in Glitch World. Yeah, but eh, achievement. Yeah. I want to jump in the third one again, because I don't know what that was all about. It was really weird. Dude, jump in the first one. I did, I died. <laughs> Repeat joke. Yeah, when you jump when you jump in the third one, it just resets your game. Well, is there anything in, uh, like, past the third pipe? No, I tried to look for something, but no. Oh boy. Just thinking of me. There's, a, there's only me and you, and several other dudes around us on the dance floor. Oh, you found the bow, uh, a bow and arrow. I just, did. Just didn't catch that. Yeah, the moon bow. You know it's a Flay the Concord song, I should have took the time to, to know. What? Woo a lady. Although the only thing is, is it's too lyric heavy of a song without having much of a chorus to it. It is. Medieval play. My, um, uh, my favorite, uh, soundtrack from anything in the past year that I have, like, of media I've consumed within the past year, <laughs> I found... Ooh, from... Ali's, Ali's got some, uh, the humans are dead going on. Zero, 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 oh, zero, 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 one, zero, 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 one, zero, one, zero, one, one. My, I mean, the first is one, the second is free. What does she want to tell us? I, I don't know. Yeah, sh it's, uh... Fuck. They're supposed to be saying hello, I think, in binary. 
and the other one's the color from the other hidden zero 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 one 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 one. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Kitty, you have had the massage. No. But, uh, uh, my favorite soundtrack from any media I've consumed within the past year oh. has probably been the soundtrack to uh, Lower the Garden Wall I enjoyed immensely. Oh, uh, yeah. The intro theme? No, just the entirety of it. Yeah. Yeah, the soundtrack to that was fantastic. There's only like two or three songs I don't really care for on it. Mm. And uh, one of which is Potatoes and Molasses. That song can go to hell. Aw. Oh. Ali will not approve of your disdain for that song. What'd you say? Ali will not approve of your disdain for that song. Whoa, that guy just went through a wall. Was she a fan of potatoes and molasses? I don't know if she's a fan of it, but it is it is referenced occasionally. What is your favorite romantic comedy Shinda's list? Oh, okay. Ali says she only sings it to annoy, so there's that. <laughs> To annoy you? <laughs> yes. Well, not me, because I don't mind it that much, but... I guess it's, I, I guess maybe me. <laughs> I don't, uh... I don't care for that song, and I don't care for the Adelaide one. I don't remember that one. Uh... It's also sung by the Wee Bab. The Wee Bab. Oh. Oh god, Mega Man blocks. Did you know that Adelaide is played by John Cleese? No. Yeah, played by John Cleese. And did um, do you remember the uh, the aunt there, the one who was keeping that girl in the house because she turned to a demon? Yeah. Oh shit. Jumped too high. I, uh, aunt Whispers, I think was the name. And that was Tim Curry. Oh yeah, I remember looking that up because because the voice sounded familiar. There are a lot of like recognizable voice actors in that. That was that was yeah, really Christopher cool. Lloyd was in it. Yeah. Frodo! Of course. Oh shit, that's all they give you? Just those three. Okay. The singing that's by the pretty... frogs was done by Leon Redbone. Yeah. Who, if you don't know who Leon Redbone is, uh, I say for people who aren't too musically inclined towards his type of music, you probably know him as the snowman from the beginning of Elf. Mm hmm. Shit. That's Leon Redbone. Uh, whoa, it's windy. Oh shit, oh shit. I remember fuck. I remember you when you were working as a prostitute. They used to call you Jawbone. Shit. Oh, the jumping in here is hard. It's windy. Fuck. That's some hard ass jumping. Some hard ass jumping, yeah. It's pushing me back while I'm trying to. Not jump into a wall of spikes here. Chris Cross will make you jump. 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 Oh, I made it. I made it. Oh, yes. I've done all once. Alright. One, Good two. night, Allie. Good night, Allie. Good night, Allie. Ooh, Vortex Prism. That guy in the crystal area mentioned that being a thing that I needed. Don't let the Spencer oh, steal those. Fuck. Don't let the uh, don't let the Spencer's dildos and or cock rings find you find you in your sleep. Yes. For the scary times. For the night is dark and full of dildos. <laughs> or cock rings, we do not do. We do not discriminate. Discriminate. Yes. Very much so. Very much not so, I should say. Mm, quite. Mm, yes, of course. Right, Fuck is better than fun. Jump over that, jump. Oh! Shit. Spikes. 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 Also, you didn't think that this game wouldn't have Mega Man blocks, now, did you? I mean, I was I was fully expecting it. And I would have been disappointed if it didn't. In fact, I feel like it kinda had something vaguely like it earlier, but this is like straight up. Just. There you go. Oh, the Mega Man blocks. 
Oh, the Mega Man blocks you'll see. Oh, the Mega Man blocks you'll go. Oh, fuck. I feel like the collision box on those is a little further out than the spikes extend. I'll, uh, I'll have you know I was in the War of 18 Diggity, too. Diggity. Dude, we're strict no diggity household. I got the bag. No diggity. No diggity. No diggity. No diggity. I got the bag in bag in. Although to be fair I still don't know what diggity means. All I know is I heard that song on the radio the other day and they cut out the dravers and I was so pissed. They cut out the what? The opening verse by Dr. Dre. I was like, what the fuck? Huh. They just skipped the whole entire part where he's like, hey, yo, Dre dropped the verse and then Dre raps. Said it was like, hey, yo, whatever, drop the, drop the hook. I'm like, you just skipped like a minute and a half out of this five minute song. Are you fucking kidding me? More like drop a minute and a half out of this five minute song, am I right? Woo. Hey, yo, drop 90 seconds. <laughs> I like the way you work, Les. Some diggity. <laughs> <laughs> so, so. Mega Man blocks. Go fuck yourself. A nondescript amount of the diggity. Alright, I gotta get that to prism. I gotta get that prism, you boy. I found a I found a radio station recently where they played the song uh, "Fuck Feel Good Inc." and then cut out the entire rap. It's by Dilla Soul. Why? That seems unnecessary. What's there even to Don't. cut out? Well, oh, if I remember correctly, this is like um, he says something about ass crack. Ass crack. Oh, oh, big Go deal. Light. Sorry, radio stations. Light them up like ass cranks. <laughs> Ladies, ponies at the track. It's my chocolate attack. Yeah, Actually, it's I'm his stupid. fucking chocolate attack. Come on. No, no, no. You cut that out? No. You cut no, out no, his no, chocolate no. attack? <laughs> no, there's a lot of it's like, shit, I'm stepping in hot as that. It's hotter than hell. Yeah. Instead of just taking the five seconds to hit the fucking cough button on the goddamn transmitter. Yeah. Cough, cough. Don't you guys have radio stations that cut out rap in general? Uh, mainly country stations, yeah, and some Christian-run stations. But that's mainly down south and out in the Midwest. Yeah, yeah that's retarded. Yo, what time is it? Showtime. Oh, now, now to make it back with the Wattex Prism. Yeah, I did it. I also want to buy that sword, but it costs oh, yeah. money. What do you want to buy? Uh, there's a sword from this guy in a, in the a jail cell right before this area. I gotta buy that from him, but I need no muns. Gotta get those sweet, sweet muns. Also, you might want to adjust your mic, you're cutting out quite heavily. Oh, am I? Mm. Sorry, I might have been just leaning kind of far away from it. Mm. No worries, some diggity. <laughs> so, so, there's no worries, but there is some diggity. Do, do I need to I worry about the diggity? Like the yeah, I may or may not like to bag it up anymore. Quad is just taking all the hits. Save point. I mean... Oh, shit. None of them matter except for the spikes that inevitably kill me. You know. I don't think I've died from damage in a while since, like, the beginning of the game. It's just the fucking insta-kill spikes. <laughs> I 
Oh. That was one of those eyeball things. That kind of looks like what was on that mural towards the beginning of the area. Whatever. My favorite, one of my favorite radio edits of all time is from the song uh, Talk Dirty to Me by uh, Jason Derulo. Mm -hmm. Where he gets to the 2 chains part. It's like um, the uh, the line is supposed to be sold out arenas, you could suck my penis, but instead it goes sold out arenas, you could suck my woo! Woo! <laughs> Wee! Safe for radio, you know what I'm saying? Wee! Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh god damn it. Let me, let me give you the rundown of all the things you can't, you can say on radio, and all the things you, things you can't. So you can say damn so long as it's not, um, so long as it's not closing out a statement that started with God, so you cannot say God damn. Yeah. You, you can say ass so long as you do not say whole afterwards. Yeah. Um. Can you say cocksucker motherfucker in the hits? No, you cannot. You can say bitch, though. What? Really? Yeah. Well, you, the DJ, cannot. The song can. Oh. I just lost the ability to use my bow. Oh, can that thing, like, curse you? Or yeah, no? I think so. Okay. I guess that's what happened. On the radio, songs cannot reference any bodily parts, so therefore, you cannot actually say tits. You can't say arm? Uh, well, you know, like, <laughs> things in the reproductive Lewd. system. <laughs> Lewd body parts. Yes. So you can't Which say penis or vagina? You, you cannot say penis, vagina, pussy, cock, dick. No, I think, I think it glitched out my weapon, because I just straight up can't use my, uh, I can't use my bow anymore. I don't think it's on a timer or anything, I think it just broke. Thankfully I can still use my, uh, my wind stuff. I remember there was a song that just before it got popular it used to be a pretty big party song, then it kind of started getting played on the radio. Before it did, I played it once on the radio show, and I, uh, I didn't have it. I didn't have the censored version. Jump down there and get the chest. I know. I I'm just going up here first. In case there's some shit to do. So I had to censor it. I just remember there's a line in there where it's like... I can't damage this thing with spells. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah. The course is girl, uh, girl, girl your booty right. is so round. I just want to lay you down. Oh, it's I can't like, actually... I can't kill this thing. It's oh, a, that's uh, I, I think annoying. the line is I stick my Peter inside your folder. Look at all that damage it has to do to kill me. Used to murder me. Just every time I hear it, just I stick my Peter inside your folder. <laughs> what? Yeah. What are you? Is that so? I mean, okay. All right, let's get that thing in the jig, I guess. Okay. Or no, I feel so, like I feel like I can just get it on the way back. It'd be better to do the boss fight. Stick my right. Peter inside your folder. Feel that when you're getting used to the to the move uh, to the double jump, the movement is godlike in this game. Yeah, I mean, it feels really good. All right, let's kill this thing. Or oh yeah, you have to. I'm guessing it's impervious to everything except for its balls. Yep. can only be killed by his own balls. Mm. Plastic people, oh baby, how oh, you're such a dragon. <laughs> I find we currently live in a world surrounded by plastic people. Plastic people, oh, oh. 
baby, how oh, you're such a drag. This just feels like fighting an excessively long uh, Metroid boss door. <laughs> it kinda is, I think. Phew. Get out of here. So, f so finally, after I beat Cuphead tomorrow, I assume is probably when I'm gonna go about doing that. Um, probably later in the evening, of course. Um. Oh, save point. I will be, um, after I beat that game, I will be going back to the one, Whoa. the only, uh, Bloodborne. Nice. Dude, now you skip the, skip the chest. No, I know. I just, I'm just seeing what's over here. I'll be back for the chest eventually. So that I... On the next Steam sale, at the next Steam sale, may purchase Dark Souls Trace. Uh, how do I get? Mm. That looks like a secret way, but I can't get through the thing. It won't let me. Oh. Mm. Maybe it's not actually a secret way. It just looked like it. Do, do, do. I also hear that I should purchase Neo. I liked the last demo that they did before releasing. Like, the games start out really annoying, and it got a little better. It still has some Diablo-esque things that I'm not super fond of, but... I don't yeah. know. What? I'm talking about Neo, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, I'm talking about, like, the loot systems and whatnot. And as far as I knew, uh, I don't know if in the final release it's this way, but, like, you just, there's no way to organize your inventory or any of your shit, and it's, it just got really cluttered and annoying to deal with. So, there were aspects that I wasn't, like, super keen on, but it, it got a lot better from its, like, uh, first open beta to, you know, now. Hey, heavy armor. That's cool. I'm guessing that's the one that I was missing. Mm. I like these giant eyeless chicken things. through that. Oh, right, because that's part of the... Shit, I... <laughs> I fucked up the puzzle again. Okay, just jump on one. Get back on the other. And the boss fight. Oh, boy. Oh, a night do... A night duder. Just gonna paint one of them little duders over there. Dude, use Gate Force against him. Yeah, I am. Although his shield is following me, and that is. No, but I can jump into him and release. Oh. Oh, you mean I just. Okay. Gotcha. Oh, wow. That so, according to The Witcher 3, when the time of the white frost comes, do not eat the yellow snow. Yeah. Watch out where the muskies go. Okay, Force can break a few fights really nicely. Yeah. And the, this isn't even the one I'm thinking about. <laughs> I thought I just saw a shovel. Could not. This guy's name is uh, K 
Canut Kretzman. Yeah, that was a shovel. Yeah. <laughs> a little Shovel Knight reference. I feel this guy. pretty down to the wire here. This oh, I got him. Sure. Ooh. That's funny. What is? <sighs> just just out of the corner of my eye, like the shovel handle, I was like, oh, it looks like a shovel. Now, uh, oh, and that looks like a Mega Man boss sword, bro sword. Oh, Christ. Quadi I have recently begun consuming a lot of uh, pistachios recently. Yeah. How's that been going for you? Uh, they are delicious. Good. And nutritious. And, uh... Um... Okay, let's go back and get that chest. So I guess that was, like, the progression boss. Mm-hmm. Alright. Also, the bro sword isn't half bad, if I remember correctly. Hmm. Let's see how it shapes up against what I got now. It is, wow, it, the sword is alive, sword brother, and it is an 8 damage sword, so yeah, that is quite good. Okay. Oh, it looks like I have everything but one item. Oh, that's pretty cool. Weapon-wise? Uh, item-wise. Mm. Oh, that's a big sword. It's a big ol' honking sword. Let's head back down. Did I come from this area? Yeah, I think I did. Ooh. It's a lion head, dude. Um. Well. Ah! They're not real. Those are some not real spikes. Oh boy. Oh! Okay. Sweet. That wasn't that bad at all. I just have to not land on any other buttons. <laughs> okay. Back. I wonder how many lost pages I have. Chicken! Boy. Okay. So I will go grab that that treasure chest that I skipped. Blah. Give it to me. Torch. Oh, is that to light up the way to the, uh, torture dungeon? Mm hmm Because I got through... It was actually kind of nice. The dark area was not that difficult to get through. No, it really isn't. Yeah. Oh, that was a secret door. Is there stuff in here? Or no, did I come from... I feel like I might have came from this way. Yeah, that's where I came from. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> dummy. You big dummy. Alright, torch. Torch go under. Relics. See better in dark areas. Okay. Yeah, my inventory is really filling up. Which is good. Mm -hmm. I feel like I'm getting closer. Is 
the sorcerer's quarters like the last area? Mm hmm. Nice. Alright. I can't think of. Well, I can think of that one door with the key that I have to return to, but I don't even know how to activate it. Um, you also have warp area thingy still. Warp. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's right. That's the last one. I'm guessing there's a warp area in uh, Sorcerer's Domain. Yes. Yeah. Save here. This is a big room. Nothing in here, I guess. Just a big empty save room. Anything down here? Oh, the uh, previous save. Hmm. Actually, no, nothing. I'm dying for convenience. Oh shit! Now I'm dying because I'm stupid. <laughs> I love those chicken enemies. I don't know why, they're just very entertaining. <laughs> Ooh! That almost fucked me up. Yeah, I did that. Oh, I could buy that. Mm. Damn it! No, actually, I'll wait until I get to the next uh, transport point. I have enough money to buy the uh, thingamajig I wanted to get before the sword, so I can, I can buy that. Okay, those are immediately breaking rock blocks. Fuck, fuck, oh! Shit. <laughs> All the way back here. Actually, mm, no, I don't want to go all the way through all these areas again. Suddenly I have to do the, uh, broken stuff jump, and I'm totally flubbing it. Damn it! So, Claudia, I got something to tell you. Mm -hmm. It's a little bit of advice. Yeah? A little, a little bit of advice I was given a long time ago. But that, that advice is very simple one, but it's, don't let that spider bite you. Don't let that spider bite you. Don't let that spider bite you. Don't let that God spider bit you, or the good lord split, split you. Split you. God forbid that spider bite you. Spider bite hurt. Ah, hurt. Spider bit me. Ah. Oh, spider bite. Spider bite hurt. Spider bite. Spider bite. Spider bit. Ah. Spider bit me with a good lord split me. Oh, in your butt hole. Cooter. Where'd you get that cooter? Need falcon. Need my falcon boy. Falcon boy, dupe it, yeah. 
Yeah. Ooh. Boy. That's a big old dragon. I want to fight that dragon. Oh. Fucking hate fighting these things. They're kind of pains in the cunts. What a bunch of coots. Bunch of coots. Bunch of kunta kentes over here. Yeah. It's almost better to get hit by him because it gives you more opportunities to hit him when you're up close anyways. There we go. Three and a go. Two. Oh. You have a lot of health. There he goes. Dad. Killed you. Skulltman. Nope. Damn. These rooms are getting sassy. Damn it. Oh. Barely that may introduce my OG comic book character, Sassy Molassi. She's a strong black woman. She don't need no man. <laughs> Sounds like something that would have like come out of a seventies black exploitation movie. Yeah. Good. Good, good. Ooh, save point. Whew. Shit's getting scurry. Oh, it's a tired cloud, man. You can't do that! <laughs> I'm, can you? I'm sorry, but you can't be like... Alright, here's the next room. You have one tile to catch up and then there's a giant pit of spikes. Good luck. <laughs> it's like, fucking stop it! I have no time to react to that. Like, that, that is the one thing I'll, I'll say against this game. You gotta chill out with, like, your screen space. You have to chill out. You have to give me more than one block to acclimate to the next screen. <laughs> Cause that is just balls. Let me, let me give you some advice that Arnold Schwarzenegger once gave me. Mm -hmm. Be cool. You, have, you go to the gym every day, you feel like you're calming. You go to the gym, you're calming. When you go home, you're calming. You're just calming. <laughs> Oh, it's oh, a big yeah. crab. Oh, it's a big angry crab. Oh, it's a little heart dude in the crab. Back when me and my buddies used to work out together in high school and in college, we used to Whoa. we used to have like these inspirational talks from Arnold Schwarzenegger, yeah. like play. So it'd be stuff like it's like even if you were going for five, or even if you are going for ten, always go like you are going for fifteen. Women always look for one thing in a man, and that is muscles. Always, always be muscular. Women love it. Okay. We're like... This, thing's, this crab thing's a little beefy. Even if you think you cannot go for Sheeps. one more, you always have energy. You always have energy. Damien! Oh. Damien! Lal! It's Christmas! Lal! Christmas time is here! I have to get you the turbo man! Jamie! Jamie, my son! Why don't you sound like me, Jamie? Did my wife fuck the neighbor? He made her cookies! Those cookies are mine! Down, cookie down! Those cookies are mine! They're my cookies! I'm sorry, Sai. Si. Alright, it's, it's fine. <laughs> it's totally fine. Not like anybody will die from this. <laughs> I 
Oh, well, to be fair, didn't you guys disown him? Yeah, right? Yeah. He's, He's not yours anymore. He's a fucking goober. So He's not, not yours making, anymore. So we're not even making fun of you people anymore. <laughs> Jesus. What do you mean, you people? I mean, Negro, I mean... Hey. There's limits. <laughs> I'm talking about you Nazis. And your zombies showing up all over the place. You fang bangers. <laughs> Shit. Fell in the pit again. Fang bang up just sounds like a furry term. <laughs> it does. It kinda does, yeah. Right. Are you a fang banger? Ooh. Are you only into agenda uh, firefoxes? <laughs> ooh woo! Ooh woo! Ooh woo! -hoo. <laughs> ah, fucking hell! Getting back from here is a pain. I feel like I missed stuff in the last area because I was rushing through it, but now it's like. <laughs> Didn't you ever play that super controversial mission in uh, Modern Warfare 2, No Russian? No Russian. No Russian. No Russian. But seriously, look at this. That is all you get for warning that there's a spike pit and you need to jump. <laughs> That's just silly. Oh, I forgot to change out my shit here. Let me just jump in the pit. <laughs> Gilwins. I'm not sure if Gilwin would be the best thing for this boss or not, but whatever. Gilwin is generally one of the, if not the best choices for a boss. Yeah. What's over here? Yeah. Although there are some where it's a uh, crystal shock, like the bouncy one. Mm -hmm. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Ow. Oh. oh Jesus yeah. shit. Jesus shit. Why you guys hit me? Because you're shit, Jesus. Because you're shit, Jesus. Fucking shit. But, but I died for sins and shit. Hey, Scotty. I want to die for my sins on my own damn time. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Jesus sin dire stealer. Where do you oh. get off dying for my sins? You should die for your own goddamn sins, <laughs> you son of a bitch. <laughs> you pizza. Selfish prick. You fucking asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows, maybe some of us like dying for our own sins. Oh, you fuck. <laughs> yeah, I earned those <laughs> sins. <laughs> Damn government benefits. <laughs> Damn Jesus stealing my shit. You know, maybe if you didn't die for everyone else's sins, maybe there wouldn't be any more in the world. What are you gonna do next? Pay my taxes, you fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking asshole. <laughs> Steal my sins. <laughs> Ow. Ooh. Ow. I love these blocks that the boss keeps just dropping on my head. Oh shit. Oh, hey Jesus, if you think oh, you're so you cool, go. why don't you come up to my house and fuck my wife? <laughs> <laughs> If you wanna do everything for me, shit. <laughs> I fucked your wife for your sins. <laughs> see, Here see, now that again. makes a little more sense. It's like, you know, if, if you sin a lot, then Jesus is gonna fuck your wife. <laughs> and if your wife sins, then you don't wanna know. <laughs> I mean, you can imagine it's just the opposite, but phew, she's gonna you just, give you, you a just godly your fucking. Hand being looped up. It's about to say. Oh, thank you, Jesus. He's like, it's not for you. 
Sometimes Jesus needs a little sin too, you know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying, Jesus should get his own damn sin. A little A1 adultery. Oh, fucking loser. Can't, you know, can't get off with his own sin. He's gotta use somebody else's. He's like, oh no, I'm I'm above sinning, but you know, I'll take some of yours. It's like, <laughs> it's it's like a guilty pleasure. He's like, oh, uh, you know, <laughs> I don't sin personally, but if somebody handed me a sin at a party, you know, I'd smoke it. <laughs> I'm a social sinner. I'm <laughs> a social sinner. <laughs> You know, if I was at a market and there were a bunch of people using my church as a marketplace, you know, I'd maybe sin a little bit. I'd maybe, maybe, maybe. hang on the cross for my sins. Whatever, just... <laughs> oh wait, we're streaming. Wow, this is this is getting weird. I'm sorry, everyone. <laughs> the, the topics are getting weirder as it gets later. <laughs> oh. Isn't that, isn't that usually you, how it you, goes you at this point in the stream? Not, uh, 20 minutes after you've insulted the entire, the entire accent of a country. Yeah. Well, you know, sometimes, sometimes you just fucking deserve it. It's okay. Get a normal fucking accent. The <laughs> <You> fucks. <laughs> <laughs> I apologize to all the people of Austria that Arnold Schwarzenegger is a giant shit. And he's fun to make fun of. I would like to apologize. I'd like to apologize. What, what is this the new I apology? Yeah. Oh, he still has one. No, this is this is like when you're going home. out to a fine dinner with a nice lady I'm not and then you tell her oh. bone at the teeth. He has a second phase. Fuck me. I can't it's leave either. Body. Yeah. Apologizing is like when you go out to a really fancy dinner with a girl. Oh, and then before you okay. eat, you tell her a uh, bone app the teeth. <laughs> bone apps the teeth. Gonna get some you know what I'm saying, girl. Just gonna, gonna, gonna get some chicken permission for dinner. It's like a Pizza Hut in the garage. It's like a Pizza Hut in the garage? I had a feeling he had to have a second face. It just seemed wrong for him to die with that one little sliver left. Also, fun fact. Yeah. He got the best sword. Oh, does he? Was this yeah. optional? Yep. Oh, really? I thought Tell it was like on the the right way. But... Tell President Bush that I am in a uh, that I'm in a position to Ooh. scratch his bushes if he'll scratch one. <laughs> oh, it's a master sword, and you have to press down to pick it up. Oh, look at that hey. cute little fella, Castiel, the Sword of Light. Hey, that's pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good. Also, without uh, gay force, this fight is a clusterfuck. Oh God. Yeah, I could believe that that thing kind of saved me last phase because it takes out like half his health at the end. It's like, phew, just hit him a couple million times. Thanks very much. Yeah. Okay, let's get out of here. See, when I grow up, I want to be able to tell that whole bone app the teeth get on us. Dumbass bitch. Oh, does she think she is? You stupid ass. Potato. I want to read the description for this sword of light. Oh man, the this, uh, the last half of this stream is just going to be amazing when it goes on YouTube. Legendary oh. sword of light. This, you know, this is the equivalent of the time that I streamed the entirety of Half Life One, and got what? really fucking tired of Half Life One. That was the thing that happened. You streamed the entirety of Half Life 1? In one session, and I should not have done that, because that game does not lend well to playing whole, through the whole goddamn thing in one session. I got was lost I, uh, so many times, and I was so tired. Was I there for that? Mm, I don't think so. I think I was pretty much on my lonesome the whole time. Ooh, here's a big 300. Boy. Well, whenever I die next, anyway. I mean. Could be, you know, no. I think, uh, I don't know, I think probably the most outstandingly, uh, just strange stream was, uh, was the, uh, the one, the one talisman stream where we had, uh, the, the Goku gif in the corner. Oh, that was great, because he was making, like, a very sultry face, that Goku. What? That, that Goku was making a sultry ass face. 
Yeah. Like, he, no. he was just kind of bobbing his head. Oh, yeah. shit, I died. That stream might have been... No. The weirdest stream was the one we got talking about sock and bobbers. Wasn't that also the talisman the stream, or was that a different one? That was a different talisman stream. I don't know. I didn't the, stick basically, the, the talisman streams are the most fun. I, um... I think I stuck around, but I didn't own Talisman, and I was just kind of a weird fifth wheel to your guys' conversation. I thought you were in the game. No, I didn't own Talisman yet. I owned it the next time over. Ah, fuck! Okay, they actually come down before you even go under them. Because I felt awkward, because like, I wasn't sure if I should leave. I was like, oh, so do I leave, or... Uh... I was like, oh, I'll just stay. Maybe, you know, they'll, they'll tell me if they want me gone, I assume. Yeah. Get the fuck out of here, you nerd! I wish we told Koopa Man that that one time. Just, just get the fuck out. Koopa Man doesn't come to my streams anymore. No, he doesn't. He doesn't come to anybody's streams anymore. Whoa! I fucking killed him. What does that mean? Jesus! <laughs> Some uh, late night revelations here. <laughs> fuck. Yeah, that's right. He's in a he's in a ditch somewhere in fucking. Michigan or whatever the fuck he lives. You know, he was very unhappy that I wasn't in the Splatoon at the time. But he was a fan of that piece of shit game? I think Splatoon is cool. Like, I was- I didn't have anything against the game. My thing was just it being a system seller. Oh, and no. I, I just have a problem with the game because Koopa Man liked it. <laughs> I, mean, I just let's thought it was- the guy had some shit taste. Well, fucking I mean, I don't want to go... <laughs> fucking Five Nights at Freddy's ass, motherfucker. Yeah, okay, that, yeah. I, I remember that when we were playing Spookies. Oh, yeah, that fucking... Game. Oh, remember, there's there's a mimic. The one, remember the one time you were streaming Spookies and I was going with you, and the fucking, the fucking monsters just had no fucking tracking? Uh... What do you mean by tracking? The one with the... I mean, pathfinding. Oh, fucking, yeah, they, they were spider really... spider kept falling off the cliff. Yeah, he was really shit at his job of uh, being a spooky boy. I don't think there was a single thing in that game that even scared us in the slightest. It was fucking great. Like, you get to the mask guy, that's as far as I would ever get, because then I would just, like... I don't- I didn't really understand what was catching me with him, but, like, you just start getting stabbed, I was like, okay, that's cool. <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay, this is a lot of things. Every single right. time, I, uh... You found a note, Blue-Eyed Lion rewards courage. I already did that. Silly game. Every single time, I would see the one happy mask salesman. A monster in that game. Mm. I would just think of a. Oh, that's another one. I could have fallen in that fucking pit of spikes after all that. That would have been awful. Game, you need to give me like one. Ooh, doppelganger fight. Okay. I uh, <laughs> I I always when I'd see his face, I'd always think of this line from this one song. Where it's like, what are you two girls doing in a place like this? Don't you know this is the most swinging this joint in New York City? And then you just get the chorus of the band in the background going, no shit. <laughs> no shit. Well, this is a bouncy guy. A bouncy so yeah, every guy. single time I'd see him, I'd just get that part where it's like, this is the swingingest bar in New York City. No shit. Yeah, that's right. Come back under here. Yeah, let's just smack you to death. I got that game to work for about two minutes, and then it crashed, and then I was like, mm, good game. The toppest of kicks. I killed my doppelganger super dead. Wait, should I have used the brother? Is the brother sword important to any story stuff, Sai? Not as far as I know. Okay, good. Because it's like, it seems to be alive. Alive. Life. Dead. To be fair, always, um. Thought it to be a reference to the Sword Brother summon in SOTM. Oh, yeah. Castile. 
So I have the best armor, the best weapon, and I guess arguably the best uh, spell. So I'm pretty, pretty arguably. Kitted out. Pretty, pretty well kitted out. I'm having a good old time. Yeah. There, see? Oh, shit. Having a good time. Having a good time. Having a good time. Is everybody having a good time? Is everybody enjoying themselves tonight? Hello. To, to the sound of smooth jazz. Boopity 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 boop. 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 Oh. Hello, my name is uh, not Vladimir Putin. My name is uh, Cat of Mir Schmutten. My name is Borlov. And uh, I am here today with my uh, jazz band. Called Vladimir and the Putin, I mean Schmadamir and the Kutens. <laughs> Schmadamir and the Kutens? Never heard of you before. You sound like a fucking piece of shit. <laughs> you know what I am hey, said is my standing Elias. Hello, this is Donald Trump. Hello, I am <laughs> Cheeky Breaky. The, uh, the KGB will be knocking at your door tomorrow night. Anyway, I am now here to soothe you with the sounds of the Russian jazz. Ooh, just thought I wanted. Do 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 Mario time. It's the Mario time. Do the Mario's your tits from side to side. You do the thing. Left and right. Do it again. Mario. It's time to do the Mario. Hey Peach, it's time to do the Mario. <laughs> do the Mario! Jump on my cock until you die. <laughs> Jump on my cock and make me go. Rock your hips back and forth here. I'm coming. <laughs> Just no, like that. Did, did you ever consider the. the Mario, when he's about to come, just starts frantically humming the star theme. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, Hello, fucking kids. like a rabbit. Hello, kids. I am uh, I'm Captain Lou Albano. And, uh, drugs can and will kill. Remember, kids, if you do drugs, you you die. Be, no, you go to You're hell. You're gonna go. You, die. <laughs> you go to hell. You go to hell before, before you, die. you die. Don't don't forget to talk to your, to your teachers, your pastors, your rabbis. Oh my god. Your moms, your dads. <laughs> you go to hell before you die. All of that. Still like the fact that like he adds like an S at the end of like moms and dads. It's your like, moms and dads. Be, don't be afraid to talk to your moms and dads. Like, whoa. Mighty progressive on the whole gay thing. Yeah. <laughs> and remember, if you're gay, you go to hell Shut before up. you die. <laughs> oh shit. T tell him Mario told you that. <laughs> Nintendo loves it. <laughs> you go to hell before you die. <laughs> Do the oh. Mario. Do the Mario. Swing your always, hips. Always remember, the, always remember the words a Mario Mario. You know, the good man here. Always remember. <laughs> Minions of Bowser are gay. You want to be like that? You want to be like those fucking friends? Ooh. Uh, so Remember, golden skill. You work for oh, Bowser. You go to hell before you die. <laughs> you work for Bowser. I'll fucking kill you, <laughs> and I'll send you to hell before you die. <laughs> oh, shit. With my plumber dick. I'll send you to heaven and hell. Before you die. <laughs> that sounds more like a Guilty Gear character, actually. Or like a Guilty Gear fight intro. I'm gonna send you to heaven, then to hell, you fuck. Heaven or hell. Destroy it. Destroy it. Guilty Gear's fun. It's because I'm not afraid to name drop on stream and. Uh, I'm not here to protect the names of the innocent. Oh shit. 
Um, Clearly not. <laughs> there's this um, there's this chick who I went to high school with, uh, named. Uh, well, I'll just give her. I'll just give Stephanie her. Stephanie Rudabaker. I will just give you the last name because that's the only important part. Her name was Stegman, or as we used to change her name to Stegman. Because she, just, might as well have been. Because listen, we used to call her. We used to call her. Um, uh, I'll come up with a fake first name though, just so you guys can't Google her actual. Um, anyway. Don't worry, so I'll find a way. Stephanie Stegman, I will say. We used to call her Stephanie Destroyer of Cocks. <laughs> <laughs> Did she destroy a lot of cocks? No, because every single time, like, you'd get, like, slightly even a half chub in high school, you'd see her face and then it would just die. Jeez. What, why just... were you getting half chubs in the hallway seeing her? Listen, leave a, leave a teenager's mind alone for about 10 seconds, you get a half chub. I don't give a fuck. Alright. Half chub master. <laughs> half chub the blaster. Game of story. <laughs> yeah, right. Okay, now I gotta go buy the thing. She used to, you know, like the bad thing was she she used she thought she was hot, so she used to wear like you know, like yoga pants and shit. Hey yo, I'm hot shit. Look at my yoga pants. Oh. So, but like the worst thing was she used to wear them. And like she was just fat, so it was nothing but like a fucking like she basically had like dinner biscuits, and like you know dinner rolls in her fucking pants. Jeez. You're like, oh Christ, take it off, and then put on, put on a fucking trash bag. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> hell, man. <laughs> By the way, a message to any fat chicks listening out there: don't wear. And I'm just gonna tell you this as a tip, Uncle Link's tip corner over here. Please oh, no, don't wear. Please don't pants. listen to him. Don't wear yoga pants. Listen, be happy with the way you look, but uh, don't don't make others. Um, no, nah, don't be happy with the way you look. You look you're fat. <laughs> Disgusting. Lose weight, you can eat lot or kill yourself. <laughs> well, the, the, oh, okay. <laughs> I love how Quali didn't even have anything to add to this anymore. <laughs> was just like, nah, okay, nothing. Now what I was gonna say was, I was like, listen, ladies, I don't care if you're fat, be happy with the way you look, but don't make others not happy with the way you look. Jeez. Know your body. I care here. that you're fat. It I kills my that... bone now. Exactly. You killed him before he had a chance to live. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't even wank that day. <laughs> Yuck. Yeah, I spent most of my gold on a thing that isn't as good as the thing that I got a while ago. Oh, it does shoot thunder occasionally, though. That's fucking awesome. By the way, I want that to be a coming attraction in the fucking description of this video. It's like, uh, everybody... There's a part where Link and Psy fat shame. Stay tuned. Not fat shame. <laughs> no, no, we give you tips and tricks on how to make tips your life tricks. better. Tips and uh, I'll tricks. I'll be one... But, like, a quick serious time, I'll be 100% honest here. You know I mean, I'm a fat guy. That, that, that's not meant to hurt you. I'm, like, way too big. And, like, no, this whole thing of, like, body change. acceptance, anti fat shaming thing annoys the crap out of me. Because, <laughs> because yeah, I'm fat. A lot of people can say I'm fat. I don't mind. I know that I'm fat. It's like. Of course, fucking doctors and shit should be able to uh, to go like, hey, uh, you're you're a beast. You should be able to just wait, you know. And no, sorry, the, no, the whole thing of, of women being all like, no, it's fat shaming. Go jump into a gas chamber, stupid slut. <laughs> No, you see, si, it's not, I don't it's think not, it's um, it's the aspect of of it's not a doctor it's being concerned for your health. I think it's just. I don't know. I don't know what point I'm trying to make, but... When it's unnecessary mocking, I think that's... What is unnecessary mockery? That's exactly the problem here. Um... See, being kind of cruel to somebody? When See, I think it's necessary. But... I think it's necessary hypothetically, to... fine, whatever. I'm just saying, like, you know, it's not the really best taste. No, I think it's necessary to roll fat people, especially fat chicks, down a hill if you're near one. So you could be like, yeah, it's right, you fat bitch, if you weren't so fucking fat, you wouldn't have rolled. Not I'm just saying from the standpoint of, 
like, the ultimate rule of don't be a dick. Like, that's... That's all. You don't- yeah, if you don't need to be a dick, don't be a dick. If you- you gotta be a dick sometimes. Okay, fair. If you don't have to, you know. And if it's directly impacting somebody, I'm not saying now. I'm just saying, like... I don't know. You hear that? Fat People lady probably out for you. <laughs> yeah. He's looking out for you. I Uncle got you. Claudie's got you. Got you. You just implicate- the uh, implicate- they call Ellie fat? No. Jesus well, see, Christ. see, that's the thing, is Allie would probably consider herself fat. And I'm just saying some people deal with that shit in terms of, like, self-image, and that fucking sucks. And so, I don't think they need the additional, you know. Well, Qua well Quaddy, first of all. You're fat. <laughs> first of all, yes, you are fat. Second of all, you are fat. Yeah, if you're... If you're Make him person, fat. <laughs> Thinner, wider. Well, no, it's um, the community wait, wait, wait. episode make him fat. But anyway, uh, what I was gonna say though is quiet. Mm. See, if your woman thinks she's fat, that's on you. Because you should wake up every morning and go, Look at you, you beautiful lady. You lady. That's not how that works. That isn't how that works. Uh -huh. And then. Every single time I ask, am I fat, your answer is always no. Unless they are, in which case you go, yeah, you fat piece of shit. No, but the important part is when the like, do these trousers make me look fat? <coughs> you go, no, nah, it's not the trousers. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's bring this thing up here. And... Crystal dongle. Oh man, it makes Take it a as crystal a tower. Take, Take some advice from a man who is almost married. When a woman asks, do these trousers make, my, make me look fat? They're always looking for the answer, yes. So then that way they throw in another pair. Because that's all they want to do. They just want to throw in another pair. Because odds are, wherever you're going, they don't care to go to. Whoa. And neither should you. Ooh, hello there, freaky boss thing. So remember, ladies, as men, we like to be upfront. So be upfront with us, that way we don't have to play your fucking game. Because you why your game doesn't have any fucking rules. Yeah. We tried to figure them out, but we couldn't, so we just made our own. It's like it's like playing the fucking Pokemon card game. <laughs> <laughs> that's good, good, good analogy, Link. Quality. We, we looked up I just, I've been thinking about it a lot. <laughs> it's really hard to play the Pokemon card game. <laughs> the greatest thing would have been like a free hour tangent there. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta go all the way. Like a tech face. Nobody understands the shit. So you just go, fuck it. Tap all your shit and be done with it. <laughs> I remember, I remember, what me and my friends used to do with our Pokemon cards, we used to light them up at the lighter and use them to light cigarettes we found on the floor. <laughs> Pokemon card game was a great time. <laughs> Pokemon TCG, yeah, 